Even in the fast-paced and restless city life, you can find peace and serenity in a place where nature never hurries. You can't control the chaos in the world, but you can control the way you see the world. Good morning everyone. I'm out at a park near home and although you cannot tell by the video footage, it is still dark. The air is calm and the sun will rise in the next few minutes. It has been a long time since I tried taking photos in such low light, so I want to try fit a few in before the sun comes up. I'm using a telephoto lens this morning because I have been using my macro lens a lot lately and I want to change things up a bit. I crouch down low near the ground and find some flowers to focus on. A man came over with his dog while on their morning walk, and we ended up spending the next several minutes talking about the park and the flowers. He was curious about what I was doing and had lots of questions. And just like that, the sun was up. Now I'm distracted again by this brave soul flying around in the sky. I guess he was taking advantage of the zero wind skies. It must be beautiful up there early in the morning. The plan for this morning is to leave the lens extended to 400mm and the aperture at 5.6 the whole time, which is as wide as it can be at 400mm. I'm able to hold the lens fairly steady and since there is no wind, I have the shutter speed set as low as I can get away with. All I have left to play with is the ISO setting. The sun has wasted no time in rising quickly. I admire this field of flowers for just a few more moments and then make my way down deeper into the meadow. I have the lens hood on this morning because I don't know when I might be finding a composition where the lens needs to point towards the sun. These little white clover flowers are everywhere. This eastern cottontail is enjoying the damp grassy area next to the pond. I notice the bunny is sitting still and I try my best not to disturb it as I slowly step closer and closer. Thank you. 
At the same time I spotted this butterfly, I also saw a large snake swimming in the water. A gentle reminder to keep watching where I step in the grass. And so, as I scanned the grass, I saw another butterfly. This dragonfly has been moving around a lot from one plant to another. If I can get one quick picture of it, I'll end my walk and head back home. Thank you all for joining me on this nature walk, see you next time!